Hi guys, welcome back to another vlog. I'm starting off a weekend in my life vlog today and it is currently Friday afternoon so I thought it would be perfect timing. I'm about to head out with the girls. We're going for dinner and drinks tonight. This is my outfit. It's actually, okay, it finally feels like, well not really finally but it's definitely not summer anymore and it's actually starting to get quite cold. Like today it felt like a winter day. It was actually chilly. I've been wearing this long sleeve top all day today and I'm honestly not mad about it. I really like winter fashion. Boots. Where are these boots from? I actually don't really remember where I got these boots from. I've had them for, I think, a, a few winters now. Um, if I can find anything similar, I'll leave them linked down below. But I'm sure you could probably find these on quite a few different uh, websites, to be honest. I think every shoe brand is starting to bring out all of their winter collections. So we've got knee-high boots. This skirt is from D Only. You guys probably have seen me talk about this. I bought this in... Um, my Noosa vlog, my most recent Noosa vlog, also Caitlin's there, by the way. Okay. You can see your pink hair. Um, Dionly skirt, and then this top is actually a sample. 23rd of Madison, coming soon. Yeah, this is my outfit, and then I've also paired it with my bag because I thought it looks cute with the skirt in the back. Who can guess where we're going? 20 bucks. If you can guess, I'm not going to say, but mentally think about it. <laughs> um, and you guys will see where we're going tonight, but I can guarantee you'll probably get it right. Kaylin just informed me that she has something to tell you guys. Everybody, um, if you guys could just go to Spotify <laughs> and download our latest episode of Girl Code. Plug the podcast, that baby. That would be much appreciated. Yeah. It's got so many dramas in it. We talk about Maddie's we, dating life. We have actually did spill a little bit of tea. Yeah, we, we did. About, I don't know heaps of shit. Go, 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 look. go listen to yeah. it. We actually did talk about my dating life a little bit, to be honest. I gave you guys a few little Inside. snippets. Um, so yeah, go listen to the latest episode. I leave our podcast linked in all of the YouTube videos down below. Hey, honestly, so yeah, you guys, honestly, you'll find so everything linked down below. I'm getting really good at linking things. Um, I used to never, I used to always forget to link things. And then a lot of you guys messaged me saying, Please yes, do better. And I was like, you know what? Totally fair. I'm gonna do better. It's linked down below. En route to Toddy's. I just gave it away. Where we're oh, going. <laughs> we're going to Toddy's, guys. <laughs> if you guessed it, you guessed correctly. No shocks here. No surprises. Classic. We're really excited. We're both super hungry. We've both had a pretty busy day today, um, worked work wise. So we're both excited to just um, a stage. Let the out. hair down. Let the hair go. Although I'm, I'm still on the fence about if I should go out or not. I know for a fact you're gonna like you're gonna have a sip of a mug <laughs> and be like I'm leaving my car here. <laughs> yeah, well, I'm meant to, I'm driving there and I'm saying that I'm gonna drive home because I want to go and do spin tomorrow and like I've got some work things to do but I just know that when I get there and I do have a drink I know what I'm like. You'll have like you'll see I'm the margaritas so come out on the tray and you'll be like all right <laughs> Maybe I'll just go out for a little bit and then see. Yeah. We'll see where the night takes us. We'll see. We're just waiting for Lexi to come downstairs and we're all going. How long do you reckon she'll be? It's 4.50. No. <laughs> Margo's down. Margo's Kakawa's. Margie's <laughs> fuck. <laughs> <laughs> oh. The girls are on one tonight. Oh my god, the night noodle markets are postponed. <gasps> I literally was just saying to you that I was really excited. Hi. Hi. Look who's back on the vlog. <laughs> Let's try it. Do a taste test. Hi! Clear as I can go on Skyscraper. No, I took yours. No, that's, that's, that's not. Oh, I'm oh, sorry. I'm stealing your drink. Oh. Um, we're at Tony's and I was oh, wearing this. I got a mug, I swear. I was wearing this. Sweaty. And I'm actually it's on that so one. Hey. You guys are in the intersection. And you guys didn't see me. And I was like, such a loser. I was like, oh, I was like, right there. You guys are tuning in. You are so focused. I can see absolutely nothing. Oh my god. Anyways, it's Friday afternoon. We're feeling good. We're on the mark. Maddie Woolley. Hello. It's what? Oh, I'm like, hello. I'm on photo. Where are we? I said that. I was like, can anyone take a guess where we are right now? Where I'm taking photos.
I have lost my voice this morning. So if you are wondering what is going on, that is that. I don't know what's happened. I just woke up this morning and my voice is gone. So ignore that. I just got back from the gym. I went and did a 5K walk this morning and I just did a food shop as well. We have Brussels sprouts, a zucchini wraps, this what is this called? Pak choy because I have a prawn laxa that I'm going to make this week. Um, and then we have asparagus, sweet potato, garlic. I'm making a um, garlic tofu. I'm making a stir fry noodle situation. Broccolini, rice. We have some minestrone soup, a whole heap of chili tuna. It's my new obsession, as you guys know. Um, yogurt, eggs for breakfast mushrooms for stir fry and also scrambled eggs with mushrooms stir fry stuff um onion onion my two of my favorite juices and then also i saw this and i love love rolled rice paper rolls and this is the sauce i use so i might make some homemade rice paper rolls at some point in the upcoming week i had the best time last night as well with the girls we had so much fun i think i have obviously just been like screaming and squealing and just so overexcited with all of my friends again that i woke up this morning and my voice just, just absolutely disappeared um so i apologize that it sounds so bad i don't know like it really does sound really bad um anyways right now i'm just cleaning my apartment 2 p.m i've had such a productive morning this morning like i said i did a 5k walk on the treadmill and i felt so good got a coffee i'm gonna go ahead and put all of this stuff away we've got rubbish to throw away also, last night when I came home, I ordered pizza, lol. <laughs> um, so I've got rubbish to throw away. This is my cleaning stuff. This is like honestly my ideal Saturday. is like going to the gym, doing a big healthy food shop, cleaning the apartment and just having some real chill vibes. I still need to shower from the gym, um, which we can do that in a little bit and do some skincare and stuff. But this is what I'm going to be doing for the next little bit. And I honestly am so excited about it. <laughs> On. anyways so annoying literally spend the whole afternoon cleaning i clean the whole outside i'll show you guys in a second but i washed all of the outside windows i mopped outside as well because with all of the rain it just like had gotten so dirty and disgusting out there so i cleaned outside i still have to vacuum inside um but i feel so good i feel like i've had such a productive day today which is really nice put in a little bit of my virtue healing oil this is really good the stuff i use like literally all the time i use this oil basically every single day and my hair is so good i actually don't know what's happened to my voice like this is so weird i also tried to scrub off my club stamp on my arm but it's like really not coming off <laughs> really embarrassing uh, walking around with like a old club stamp i was really reflecting the other day as well about how i really enjoy balance in my life for instance i went out last night had the best time with my friends i ate lots of food we had pasta wine cocktails pizza burrata and then today i've obviously done a really healthy food shop and i just think that's like a really important thing to note is like you can do both and it's something that I want to talk about is because I feel like sometimes I think, um, for me in particular as well, it's bad of me to do like nights out with my friends and having fun. So on my skin, I wash my face in the shower and I'm just putting on my Charlotte Tilbury Collagen Superfusion Facial Oil. But like I was saying, I just think it's, I remember like when I was younger, especially going through high school, I used to think that I had to be either one or the other. Like I had to do either the, um you know, staying in every weekend, working really hard, no drinking, no partying. Um, otherwise, I'd feel like I was being bad or cheating or whatever. And I just feel like as I've gotten older, I just think balance is everything. And I really, I think um, we talk about, I talk, I talk about this in my podcast a lot as well, Girl Code, if you guys don't listen. But I think especially in your 20s, obviously at any point in life, but I think especially in your 20s, sometimes myself included can get carried away with having everything together and like oh my god um and you know 
just feeling guilty for going out and having fun and drinking and being hungover. Um, but it's balance. Like, you can do both. You can be a boss and also party and live your life. So I just wanted to put that out there because if anyone is like me and sometimes, you know, you feel like, oh, I shouldn't be going out, like, this is bad, like, blah, 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 I need to, like, get my shit together and, like, focus. Like, you can do both, guys. You can do balance. Balance is important, okay? We want to live our lives. And like I said, I talk about this a lot in that podcast, so make sure you guys listen. Anyways, that's my little rant for them. That's my little Saturday rant over. So speaking of balance, I had that leftover pizza for lunch today. And tonight we're going to make <laughs> salmon and roasted veggies, I'm pretty sure. We'll see how we go, but that's pretty much my skincare done. I'm just gonna let that oil soak in. I'll leave this oil link down below as well if any of you guys want to check it out. I really, really like it. Like, I need to stop speaking. This is ridiculous. It's dinner time, guys. I'm just getting all of the ingredients out to cook dinner. I was going to make salmon, but I actually kind of feel like having this black star kit that I have. You guys have seen me make this before on my channel, but I just felt like that tonight. So we have the kit this is what it looks like love and then you just add your own veggies so i'm gonna add the pak choy wait i'm gonna bring you guys over here hang on <clears throat> so i'm going to add so i'm going to add prawns chilies pak choy and then that's pretty much it i actually don't really have anything else to add to this um, it says you can add bean shoots, mint, and chili, and I've got pak choy chili, but I don't have mint, but that's okay. Or bean shoots, but that, that's okay. I'm actually really craving dumplings for dinner tonight. I always try to know where to put this camera on. Let's see if I can put it I was really craving, I was actually really craving dumplings before, but I don't want to order Uber Eats again, especially if I just went food shopping today, obviously. So, I'm having a black stone set. I just didn't feel like salmon. So, let's see. Let's open this up. Guys, I feel so good. My apartment is literally spotless. I vacuumed and mopped the floors, and I'm just feeling really good. I honestly think there's nothing better than having a clean space. I feel like, for me personally, the same clear space, clear mind is so true. I feel like I'm just so much more. Oh, some traffic going on outside. I feel like I'm so much more. I just feel a lot better when my space is clean, is what I'm trying to say. So let's pour this in. Also, you could probably make this without the packet. I just don't really know how to make it, so I'm using the packet version. But I'm sure there's a way. You can make it without the packet if you don't want to use the packet. <clears throat> I still can't get over my voice. This is just ridiculous. I don't know what's happened. I've never lost my voice like this before. I don't think I've ever lost my voice like this. Weird. <laughs> It's like 9 p.m. I've just been watching Netflix on the couch after I had my dinner and chilling. I've got an early morning workout tomorrow. I'm gonna go do a spin class. We'll see you guys in the morning. Hi guys. It's been a couple of days. I know, oh my god, my dry shampoo is all over my shirt. So it's been a little bit. I had originally intended to make this vlog a weekend in my life vlog. I was gonna vlog the whole my whole day on Sunday, but as you can probably tell, my voice was gone it's tuesday today and i have not been able to speak for the last two days like i had so many meetings on monday that i had to cancel all these things that i had to do and i just i i couldn't even speak like today it's starting to come back a little bit but it was completely gone i'm not sure why i don't know what's happened i feel fine <laughs> just lost my voice anyways um 
but I am continuing this vlog on today so we're just gonna make this a little bit more of like another week week in my life couple days in my life whatever so Sunday I think the last time I spoke to you guys was on Saturday and Sunday I just had a really chill day at home like I said I didn't leave my apartment because I could not get a word out um, so I just had a very wholesome weekend I did go to the gym um, went food shopping did all that jazz um, did all that stuff and then yesterday like I let like yesterday I had to cancel all my meetings and I had just another home day working from home I do have a very exciting delivery to show you guys that I built it took me a really long time to build yesterday and I'm not gonna lie it got delivered and I had to really trek it up here it's so heavy the table is like I think it was like 45 kilos or something and I had to lug it from the basement because of course the lift was broken when it got delivered um not even like it, I dragged, I dragged it. <laughs> um, so I'll show you guys that in a second, but it's our dining, it's my dining table and I'm really, really happy with it. I'm so happy with the apartment now. I'm like, oh, it's just my dream apartment. It just makes me really happy. So I'll show you guys that in a second. But today I'm getting ready because I am shooting content with Caitlin today. The first day that I'm actually leaving my apartment, really. We were also supposed to record our podcast, but I'm just gonna have to put that on hold because um, my voice is non-existent. So, yeah, we're just shooting content today. I haven't taken photos in a while um, It's my birthday next week, and I have so much planned That's why I'm just like haven't really been in the mood to like go out and shoot because next week. There's so much on um, And I'll obviously be taking a lot of photos and stuff, but today I figured I should get out of the house I should get out of the house and be productive with my day um, Anyways, I'm gonna show you guys the dining table now walk through and we have a dining table yay oh my gosh it's been nearly a year this is what it now looks like I love love it so much it looks so good guys <laughs> I'm so happy this whole dining set is from Temple and Webster which is such a steal I feel like Temple and Webster has so many cute pieces um, so if you guys are on the hunt for any new furniture things I'd definitely recommend I'll leave this linked down below it's not sold as a set um, but I just found the chairs that I loved and then obviously the dining table I knew that I wanted a round one just because I think the space there's so much like rectangular Pieces of furniture, so I thought a nice round table would look really good here on top I've just put this Italian Cookbook that I got from my friend Georgie in a PR pack and then I also have this stunning orchid Which my friend Kaylin got me as well. I had breakfast here this morning um, and it's just really nice to sit and have such a beautiful view and the weather guys today is the best day I swear I'm hoping it stays like this for my birthday next week um, And yeah, so we have a dining table. Okay, we're just in my bathroom. I'm finishing getting ready by doing my hair This is the heat protectant that I'm using today the Kevin Murphy ever smooth GHD straightener and then I'm just gonna go and I'm just gonna go ahead and touch up my hair because I actually haven't done anything to it today I think I'm gonna do like wavy hair because I think it's a little bit too crazy to straighten and I don't know if it'll look like really smooth straight which is the only type of straight that I like I also put dry shampoo in my hair and it's put literally stuff all over my top anyways anyways I'll show you guys the end result of what my hair looks like oh and I'm gonna use the Way wave spray this stuff is honestly so good these two i really really like hey guys i said i would show you the finished look and i'm obviously in an uber i'm with k-rod hi i'm um, so angry <laughs> that's me whenever i'm on my phone i look so grumpy <laughs> but this is the finished look i said i was gonna wave my hair but i ended up just straightening it I, I always just feel so much better when my hair's straight i think it's just mommy we are going to lunch and this is oh no okay sorry um, we're going to lunch right now because we're both starving and we're doing Hangry. some content stuff today like I mentioned but this is the first look that I'm shooting it's a white shirt mini skirt and some boots yeah we're both pretty hungry we both get hangry I'm so stressed mm. because I can't find <laughs> what so you're looking for I hate going to places like restaurants anywhere without looking at a menu mm -hmm. like I know what I'm ordering every time before I get anywhere and I've been to this place before and I can't find the menu online but I know what I ordered so I'm the trying to straight on part three I'm trying so hard to find the story that I made eating the food so and I can't find it what it was. I just want to find it. Yeah, now I'm yeah, yeah. so annoyed. Oh. We're going to a restaurant called 
that made me trust up in there quite a few times. We actually, when we used to live, we used to live in Bulamalu. That old apartment Make was a right Bulamalu. turn on Elizabeth mm. Street. And it's like just kind of across the road and it's so good. It has such good Italian food. I went there. I've been there before. You guys would have seen me in the vlog go there before, but I'm just so wasn't, stressed. It wasn't the same experience when I went there last time. <laughs> I'm definitely going to get right okay. make a right definitely turn get on the street. Yeah, then I think for memory, on the left. for memory got pasta. I remember last time I got some broccoli like situation. Mm -hmm. um, I got some chippies. I also had mashed potato. Yum, you really went in, <laughs> I babe. I haven't even had two, two selections of pasta. Yeah, no. it's fucking good. I just wish I could find the photo. I'm so stressed. I can't, I can't even deal with this anymore. This is flat out. I've got my shoot bag. Funny BTS. I've also got slides so I can just walk around the city if my feet get sore. <laughs> up from my agency on the drive home so I have this big box from Fenty and I thought I would unbox it with you guys because I think that'd be fun um Caitlin and I had a very productive day out today we were just basically shooting um all afternoon it's about 3 30 p.m now we went for lunch as you guys saw in the city and then we just wandered around and did more work stuff um she just left and I just got into active work because I'm actually going to go for a walk another walk this afternoon um with Lex we're gonna go do a coastal walk and get um and get some stuff for dinner because our friend Georgie is also coming over tonight and we're having a big travel meeting the package is obviously from Fenty like I said it's the new Fenty Icon semi matte refillable lipstick so we have it here it's got my I'm really getting a lot of personalized things recently it says Madison on it which is just so cute and then there's this so we have attach base to fill, insert fill, bullet force into open end of the case. Press to secure. We have all the different shades here, as you guys can see, stunning. I definitely am going to be leaning towards, I think, the Pose Queen. I'm not really a red girl, but maybe I should try some reds because I never do. Light pink new cozy queen. Let's check this one out. This is definitely going to be my vibe. That's the shade. Love that. I can even show you guys. So I put it in first. Okay, that took me a second to understand, but I got it. So it's in there, pops in, then you just click it straight out and take it out. Wow, I'm so impressed. It even puts the label on the side. So this is what the lipstick looks like now. I can try it on. Ooh, it's quite dark. It's definitely darker than what I normally wear, but I think I really like it. I really like it. I think salad, we were getting salad stuff, everyone. Oh, we're back in the car, back with Lex. I look so bad. <laughs> I got a green juice. Um, we just finished our walk, guys. I left my camera in the car. I look <laughs> so we just went for a walk, Lex got her beautiful green juice, we're driving home now to have our Europe meeting, it's like a little team meeting this afternoon, um, our friend Georgie who's also coming to Europe with us is meeting us at mine and we're just going to try and finalise everything tonight because we leave in two months. Hi vlog, we're currently doing our Europe planning meeting. The girls working hard behind me. Mm -hmm. Hi, darlings. Yes. Um, it's like 9 p.m. We've been doing this honestly for a while and we've hit a few roadblocks, but it's okay. We are going to figure everything out. Basically, all the accommodations booked. It's just like the travel or the trains, like domestic flights within places that can be really tricky, but hopefully it's going to be all good. We leave in two months. I'm so excited. To also like outfit plan and stuff. It's just going to be so fun. I'm so excited. The girls just left. We had such a productive night tonight. We pretty much have organized everything for Europe. We're just doing, like I said, the... Oh my god, I'm so tired. 9.15, we had such a productive night. 
Um, and I'm getting up early tomorrow morning to go to the gym because I did not go to the gym today. I did do two walks today, but I didn't go to the gym and I just feel like I need to go do some abs and arm workout tomorrow. So yeah, so this is me for the night. I look so funny. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to see you guys in the morning. I did my skincare. I've got my Sunday Riley retinol oil on. And yeah, I'm going to scull some water, watch an episode of Seinfeld, and then go to sleep. Good morning. Well, actually, not good morning. I'm just so used to saying good morning. It's actually good afternoon. I have been doing work from home all day today. In a very boring admin office day today. I have not even picked up my camera once. My voice is getting significantly better, which is very exciting. It's cooking with Mads time. I just got back from my walk. I'm feeling energized. So I got all the ingredients out. We're making a stir fry classic um, for dinner tonight. Ingredients. We have garlic tofu. Love that. That's what it looks like. Cute. We've got some chili because I'm going to make it a little bit spicy. We have mushrooms, zucchini, capsicum. These are really small, by the way. Like, these are very small capsicum. A brown onion. Who remembers in one of my vlogs one time when I was like a red onion? <laughs> if you remember that, you're an OG. Um, anyways, uh, and some noodles. <laughs> these are what the noodles that I'm using look like. The Hokkien noodles. Oh, goodbye. Can I get this out? Thank you. This is what they look like. And then sauce, a vegetarian mushroom oyster sauce. Probably just going to put everything in my big wok pan like usual. If I can find it in here. That's at the very back. Okay. Excuse me. Sun is setting, the vibes are high, so I'm gonna go ahead and start chopping everything up and and I'll show you guys as we and I will show you guys as we go. I think you've probably seen me make stir fry before. Honestly, it's not that exciting. I'm just putting everything into a pan with oil, cooking it up. so good that stir fry was honestly like restaurant quality like I'm so proud of myself I really nailed that recipe guys I'm making a tea right now I'm gonna make like a ginger oh, I don't know do I want peppermint or ginger I think I might do ginger just to like cleanse um, although I do also really like peppermint tea um, and honestly I've been going to bed kind of late ish later than normal I feel like my bedtime's normally 9 to 9.30 but recently I've been staying up to like 10 10.30 which is weird for me and I've been struggling to get up a little bit so I feel like I need to get back onto my good sleeping routine. So when I'm doing like my 9.30 and 6am starts I just feel on top of I just feel on top of the world on I'm gonna chill on the couch for a little bit and watch some Netflix I've obviously showered as well I forgot to mention that but I just got out of the shower before and I've done my skincare routine drink my tea drink a bottle of water I just refilled my water bottle watch some Seinfeld I've been obsessed with Seinfeld again I'm so into I'm just really into like oh I love all of the old 
classic TV shows. Like, I love Sex and the City. I love Seinfeld. I love Friends. I like, the classic OG TV shows. Those are my faves. Um, so, I'm just re-watching Seinfeld. I'm up to season 6, episode 17. And I haven't watched it in a really long time, so I'm really enjoying it. Anyways, I have a pretty busy work day tomorrow. I've got an upcoming shoot on Friday. Today's Wednesday. I've got a shoot on Friday for 23rd. We've got, um, like our massive winter collection shoot we're doing three drops over winter um, and we're doing everything in one day and then we also have a little capsule collection that we're shooting on friday as well so yeah friday is going to be a really big day and tomorrow i'm just like doing all the back end prep stuff before the photo shoot so i've got to go and print off a whole heap of things because my printer randomly isn't printing things in color which is so annoying so i've got to like print off all the styling sheets um mood boards go get disposable cameras go pick up a few things um pack the styling suitcases just all fun stuff like that